Stuntnet understand Bernard and Perlita and Dave and Harry and Ellery and Robo Knight, Pickett Street, Jamaica Street, Jim Hall, the Law, Morgan C. Jones. When you take over something that doesn't belong to you, Bernard, and you're programming with the experimentator and Tillaman and all that, and Judy Shepard and whoever else is helping you, Red Rand, the city, as you guys take it over and claim that it belongs to you, but it doesn't, Carney. Carney of the Renaissance and you know your, your monotone attitude and your behavior with Dr. Joe and all that and what you do Bernard see what happens to the consciousness of the city it becomes you guys as mockery like you're the personality of the dumb that's what it becomes instead of fun and like it used to be when you know the rightful people before you guys chased them out or killed them with your Negroes you know when it was cool and all that it becomes your guys' consciousness and personality. It's you guys' mockery. Oh, good. The plants, everything. It means it never really belonged to you, Bernard, or Karen, or Perlita. You guys just use it for political protest, and then when you're wrong or you guys lose, you just have an attitude. And, and that's what it becomes, Bernard. So they let you carny take a dump it and do all that nasty shit with Red Randy and all that, but, you know. Not everybody has to bow down to worship the bitted bat for Carney, especially if they know it worked better under other people's leadership before you guys came through and tore everything up. So, you know, Robo Rapist Night, if you're going to be a stocky rapist little LGBT or and like annoying, then it becomes that. Okay. So it proves that it actually didn't work once until you guys went super fag and ruined everybody's shit. So it becomes that dipshit. And he has he talks shit about how he owned everything and made it. He looks like a fucking liar, plus the personality and consciousness of the city reflects the cry baby Perlita and the bit of the fat and Dave and you have the Morgans and all you guys going mm -hmm. If you guys didn't want it, then why trash it? Understand? Blue boy boxes. And the more and more you guys keep stacking on crybabying over it, the dumber you guys are gonna look and sound and the consciousness and personality of the city becomes that way. It's a reflection of, uh, well, your actions and deeds and art. My stuff was that good before you guys wrecked it. It's not my fault you guys are fucking stupid.